So hey guys and welcome to another Retro Games for Cheaters with me, Supernautus, and today we're playing a 1990 Sega Mega Drive release, known in the US, in the West I guess, as Target Earth, better known as Assault Suit Lenos. Uh, what can we say about it? It's a kind of side-scrolling shooter slash platformer, and a, a bit of an action game in general. Uh, I hope you'll enjoy it. We're playing this with infinite health, infinite weapons, basically infinite ammo in all of our weapons. And uh, yeah, this was developed by, um, what was it, Messiah, um, and obviously published in the US by uh, DreamWorks. Uh, as far as I'm aware, not the, it's not the movie company, right? No, no, it is. It is apparently the movie production company, I just had a quick check on that, and it was. But anyway, this is Target Earth, because that's what's called on this one, and the first stage is the Raid on Ganymede. As I say, infinite health, infinite weapons. Those things apparently can't be killed, but we need to select our weapons. Enemy forces are approaching. Ganymede-based cyborg armor units gear up for battle. And I get to select my weaponry, so that's all good, right? So we'll have that, we'll have that, and we'll start the game. Feels very much like a kind of side-scrolling shoot 'em up uh, but obviously we're on the ground. Rather than flying through the air. Obviously, for a Sega Mega Drive game, it's got some very, I would say, some relatively dated graphics for the time, but. You know, it still runs very nicely. Okay, so those ones we can't destroy. Tiny little guys there now. What's that about? Enemy warship has passed the D line. The warship is 56 miles to base and closing. Destroy the warship. If we can, we will. what's going on in some of these scenes. Shoot it. This isn't the warship, right? This is just a ship. It's destroyed, whatever it is. Enemy warship destroyed! Enemy forces regrouping. Return to base. Result. We did it. We got some improvements there. And we're on to stage two, which is escape. We have to choose our weaponry first. Enemy troops are surrounding the base. We must retreat to Earth. My mission is to rendezvous the shuttle at the far side of the base. Let's select our weapons. Well, let's have that, because why not? And that. And that. That looks like a totally appropriate weapon for using in space. Good luck. Like I need luck. Let's go, we need to get out of here. I hope I didn't leave the gas on. You want cover and fire? You got it. We got ground support, close air support. That's good. Let's 
That's what we needed. It's a bit too close though, isn't it? I mean... <laughs> there's a good chance that we'd be caught in the fire there. A very good chance. Who's this guy? We've been hit! Ah! It's terrifying. Being hit. There's nobody left with me either. Yeah, this looks like fun. This weapon looks a bit more enjoyable. Is this the shuttle? Have we done it? Board now! Oh, I've got to jump on there, okay. We're boarding the shuttle. And we're taking off. And heading to Earth! We didn't get any bonus weapons out of that, though. Orbital attack. Shuttles are under attack. There's an enemy warship near us. Atmosphere entry in 300 seconds. Protect the shuttles from enemy fire. Select weapons now. Well, I've selected all the weapons that I can have, so... Good luck, she says. Good luck. I don't need luck. What are you talking about? So now we're doing it in more of a... More of a scrolling shooter style. Although it's uh, every direction imaginable shooter. There's a lot of them. A lot of enemies around. And a lot of areas to fire in to find them. Okay, we've reached the edge of space, apparently. I didn't know that was possible. Oh, we found their... their ship. Destroy it. Destroy the alien ship. There we go. I don't know if they're aliens. Maybe they're fellow human beings. What's up here? Nothing. Oh, there's a guy. too sure what I'm supposed to be finding here. I killed that big ship. Apparently that's not the end. And this is the Earth. Oh no, I'm burning up in the atmosphere. There doesn't appear to be much to actually do. He's shooting at something, but I don't really know what. That's the ship we just came in on. What will we find on this side of the screen? Not much. How many enemies exactly did I know? Oh, no. We need to defend these, uh, these shuttles from the bad enemies. As opposed to the good enemies. Is there a target we're supposed to reach here with this, or...? I don't really see what I'm supposed to do, because I see, feel like I've cleared the entire area.
of enemies, to be honest. I mean, other than little enemies. Up we go. This level's quite long. Aha! Atmosphere entry in 60 seconds. Looks like we just have to defend them until the time runs out. Okay. How am I supposed to get in? Yes! We have to get in. I don't know if... Uh... I think I should have stayed outside for a little while. Can this ship survive? 32 seconds. Time's almost up. You must get inside. I'm inside. You must get inside before the hatch closes. I'm inside. The only thing I'm concerned about is, are, is this ship going to survive long enough? I guess it is now that we're in. Let's go. Close the hatch. And let's get the heck out of here. Hopefully we don't burn up on re-entry. Oh no, is that not the worst way to land? Like, hey, we'll just put the whole flat belly of the ship straight down. Oh, we've got some better weapons here now by the look of things. A B pack? What's that for? As opposed to an A pack. Frontline assault, here we go. We're here on Earth. Assault suit. Units ready for drop. Select your weapons now. Or later, but it would be better to do it now, to be honest. Can I take stuff away? Right, let me just... Take all this stuff away. And decide what we want instead. The launchers actually aren't particularly useful, in my opinion. But what has been... Well, let's try the missiles. Try that. That one's not bad. I like that. Yeah, that'll do. Let's do it. Return safely, she says. Well... Can't guarantee it. But we'll do what we can. Ah, falling! Oh yeah, that looks good. It's a falling mode now. We're in falling mode. Move on! Move on? I think I'm some kind of travelling... Nuisance. Move on, I said. I thought we were going to sink in the water for some reason. Yeah, that's definitely uh, a stronger weapon than any of the others we've had so far, isn't it? I've got a rocket booster. Oh, that was the back. That was the pack that I put on, wasn't it? It's a boost pack. Now this weapon, the downside of that weapon is that I can't adjust the angle of fire. So there has to be a downside when it's such a high speed rapid fire weapon. Rapid fire. Destroy all these little bunkers. Go. Let's try a different weapon. Aha, what's this? Stand clear, we're blowing an entrance. You're blowing an entrance. 
Destroy the enemy's reactor down below. The base must be destroyed. The reactor or the base? Make your mind up. That's an awfully big jump I just did. I know we've got to destroy the reactor, but... Oh no, I got electrocuted! I don't have too much concern about that. There is a bit of a... An issue with... The way these weapons work. There we go. So yeah, a couple of little electrical traps, I guess. Down we go. Let's see what's down below. Where's the reactor? Right at the bottom, maybe. And then I'll get a time limit to get out, and that'll be where I fail. No. I have no idea where I'm going right now. <laughs> causes a little bit of a problem, right? Well, I know I've got to go and find the reactor. And destroy the base, apparently. That looks like a reactor to me. Is that it? Operation completed! Return to base. And that'll probably just take me straight out of here without me having to do anything. Yeah, there we go. So we've got a 40 SC missile pod and a 40 SC. Wait, we've got two of those? Surprise attack, stage 5. You've got to surprise them by attacking them. Time to take your turn at patrol duty. Got to guard station A1. Select my battle gear. And I will choose everything I've got here. Uh, what was that? No, I didn't want... Okay, apparently I have to do that. I don't have a choice. Uh, what I did want was this. That. Let's try the missile pod just to see what it's like. And that one. That'll do. We installed a new comm system in your attack armour. Now you can listen and talk on the enemy's communication network. Good luck! So wait, we can we can talk to the enemies? Where's the enemies at? They say the enemy commander is out to get you! Once our new warship's completed, we will be able to make a surprise attack on the enemy's HQ. Right, okay, but for now we can't do that, right? Ah, he blew up. Why did he blow up? Too much talking. And he blew up because of too much talking, didn't he? A five count? What does that mean? just listed how many enemies I've killed. Okay, we're good. For now. 16. It's nice, it tells me exactly how many enemies I've killed. Great. Go 24. Just keep firing. Good job. Everything sounds so triumphant. I said I was supposed to defend base A1, right? 
Should I have just stayed there? I think this is the end of the map, isn't it? This is the end of the screen. So how many enemies am I supposed to kill before this is deemed a success? And I should have been defending base A1. Doc, Zah, unit Zah, what? I'm, in, I'm intercepting enemy communications. What? Communication? Intercepted? Hey, you're the assault suit pilot who keeps ruining our plans. I am. Who are you? I'm Rance Kelsus, commander of the elite attack suit wing. You have foiled our plans for the last time. Now I will destroy you. No, you won't, mate. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but you won't. Sorry, I just have to destroy that first, just so you don't get in while I'm busy with you. Fleet something. Our fight will have to wait. I'll be back, Rex. Retreat. The enemy's falling back. Our base is safe. Good job. Get away, you. It's a pity I can't actually destroy him. But there we go. Uh, we got a missile and grenade launcher bonus. Oh, an armor too, and a missile pod, but we got all that. Already, so we'll just carry on. Headquarter Blitz. It's like a ballroom blitz, but in the headquarters, you see. Now approaching enemy headquarters. Assault suit. Prepare for launching. Select battle gear now. I select all of that I've already got selected. Good luck, prepare for launch. Prepare for lunch. So are we blitz in their headquarters or are they blitz in ours? I'm confused. Just make sure we destroy everything that we see if we can. There was a ship up there that I missed. It was going to run right into the cliff face anyway. You'd think they'd know their planet and where their headquarters is and not fly into cliff sides. Wait a minute, I want to see. That's not obviously that. I, I kind of want to see if these things will fly into a cliff face and blow up. But at the same time, I kind of want to finish the level too. The jetpack's quite the rocket pack, whatever it is. Boost pack, maybe. Is that what it is? Look at that. It's like a crazy ship. And I just absolutely annihilated it. Are there more of these? I got it! Wait. Is that it? Fire at will. Nice and easy. There we go. Now just keep shooting. Kill them all. All of them. That's a lot of guys. They're all coming after me. Definitely need the jetpack, the rocket pack, whatever you want to call it, for this stage, because there's a few jumps there that I don't know if I would have made without it. So it's definitely a recommended piece of equipment to use, I think. When you manage to get hold of it. Keep clear, we're bombing you! Well, you're bombing me! The way's open, move in. Keep clear, I'm bombing you now. It shouldn't be bombing me. Maybe the position I'm in, yes, but not me personally. Seems like, if in doubt, just go to the bottom of these stages. Seems to be a pretty standard way to fix, you know, to, to complete the sections. 
or just move wherever you see enemies. I don't even really need to kill anything, to be honest. I could probably walk through most of this without killing anything apart from the required targets. I don't even know if going down was the right option here. That probably was. Can't destroy that thing. Oh, it's like a big Gatling gun. Well, not a very good one. It destroyed it in like... Not too concerned even about these gun placements on the wall because... Spider robots! They would be a bit of a pain. Obviously. Oh, it's like a crazy assault suit. You're very good to have made it here alive. Rants, what's going on here? This is a Cron Cyborg creation system. What? But who are you? We're the survivors of the Outer Space Expeditionary Party. We left the Earth a hundred years ago with all of man's hope. But we had trouble at the edge of the solar system. We radioed out for help, but there was silence. Now the Kron system keeps us alive. We've been forsaken and are here to take our revenge. Maybe the communication stopped working, but a hundred years ago there was a world war. We had to rebuild from the ground up. There was no way Earth could have responded, communicated with you. Your expedition held hope for us all. We never gave up that hope. Now look what a failure to communicate has caused. War! It's regrettable, but it is too late to stop now. But you could just, if you're in charge, you could just say, alright, okay. They shall never reconcile, even though it was a mistake. Never reconcile. It's a bit crazy, isn't it? You know, oh, we didn't mean it. We thought you'd, we thought you'd died. We thought you were still alive. You will never win, he says. Look at this, he's, he's flying away. What a coward. This is Rex to base. We have control over the Kron area. Repeat, we have control. Nice. That missile uh, pod's actually quite quite good. Space colony smash. The enemy's using a captured base as quartermaster supply for their ships. We must recapture the colony and destroy the enemy's weapon supplies. Select weapons now. I'm not going to change anything. I think what we've got is fine. Be careful out there. I don't think we picked up anything new either. This 150BZ seems to be the best. Uh, watch out for the mines, guys. What's all this? Oh, this is where... This is the base they've stolen, is it? This is the place they've been using to improve their situation. There we go, we're in. We're in. Take care. Well, okay, I will. It's like a city in here all of a sudden. Three count. I'm supposed to destroy those things, aren't I? Looks like it, yeah. To stop them resupplying. seven down. I don't know exactly how many there are to destroy, to be honest. But that's eight. That's ten. How many are there going to be under? So the stages can, be, can feel quite long, actually. Um, and there's always action going on. Always action. I don't even care about these guys. All I want to do is destroy their little uh, things, right? Destroy their little things. There we go. And we're moving on. Blowing up all the gates as we go. Is that all I'm supposed to do from there? Yeah, it must be more over to the right here. Let's see. 
There's an enemy warship. Do not let it get away. Attack. Oh, look, it's blasting up. Where is it? There it is. Is this actually firing? Yes, it is. I'll just use this, because this does a lot of damage. I think we did it. I'm quite happy with the weapons I've got, I think. Stage 8 is the final conflict. Will it be the final conflict? I don't know. We're now attacking the enemy fleet. Win this battle, and the war will be over. Salt suit units, prepare to launch. Select your weapons now. There's obviously something new that I've got. I'm quite happy with the weapons I've got, so... Return safely, I'll miss you. Liana, I'll be back soon. This is our last time. Oh, he's going to die, isn't he? It's like in a war film, you know. Some guy says, oh, I've got all this family to go back and see, and it's going to be great, and then they die because... Because that's how you make a sad film. Oh, this guy was looking forward to going home and seeing his mother and parents. And now he's gone. His mother and parents, yes. Because they're two different people. He's Jack Nicholson. Wait. I don't think he is, but... <laughs> Go away. Where are these ships that are shooting at us? I got all them shooting at something, but I just keep moving towards where the fire's coming from. I could use the uh, missile pods; they're quite useful. Goal is the enemy flagship. Let's go! I thought it was the goal is the enemy flag. We're playing capture the flag with the enemy. Where is their ship? Is this the flagship? I don't know, that's a ship we can't destroy apparently. Now that's why you need to destroy the uh... Oh no, actually that doesn't seem to have done much. This must be the flagship, surely. Just missile pods all the way for this. Quickest way to defeat it. These aren't hitting anything anymore on this ship. Does that mean it's done? Doesn't appear to be anything to hit on this ship. Maybe that's not the flagship then. There's still enemies coming from over here. Whatever that was, we managed to destroy it. Seems like these missile pods will still be useful against this initially. Apparently we can disable its weapons with that, although we can't kill it. This looks big, but is it bigger than anything else we've had so far? Well, this has to be the flagship, surely. Come on. My god! So we meet again. Rance, you're still alive. I became a cyborg in order to survive. This is the legacy of Kron. Now I'll defeat you and bring myself from the bottom of this mechanized agony. Dive into that opening. It's the only way to gain entrance to the flagship. You're a good warrior. What opening? Wait! Okay. Well, we're floating the whole way. I don't need a missile pod to take these things out, right? Really? I think the missile pod would be overkill slightly in this situation. I don't care about any of this, I just want to kill the guy. Finish the war. Finish the fight, as some people might say. Their names were Master Chief. We're 
gonna do it. Oh, there's not some sort of cliffhanger. <laughs> After me saying that. Okay, uh, what's over this way then? There's a wall there. Ah, oh, this looks like the right way. Looks like a completely different area we're arriving at. There he is. I will not let you go any further. I don't think you're gonna have a choice, mate. Obviously, if I didn't have infinite health, this would probably be a problem, but I do, so of a space shotgun on the go. Battle's already over. We've won. It's not over as long as I remain standing. Not yet. I can still blow up. You can still blow up. Another good man dead. Who's behind all this evil? Well, was it, was it not him? Is there someone else? Behind the scenes? Oh, hello. You defeated Rance? You're brave. You're the enemy commander. Surrender, the war's over. Surrender? Ha! Ah, there can be no surrender. When we were abandoned in space, we developed Kron technology to keep us alive. Yeah, I've been told this already. We became part man, part machine. In order to become the law enforcement officer of the future. No. To survive, we always hoped that one day when Earth had fully recovered from the war, they would welcome us back. But when we finally established communications, they told us that we were on our own. The Earth gave us up. There was no misunderstanding. Now you shall die. Very quick uh, decision that, wasn't it? You must die now because some people on Earth said we were on our own. Because they had a war to fight, mate. What am I supposed to be destroying here? Everything seems to be homing in on his on the bottom of his little platform there, but... Aha! Now you die. Or, do, or does he? shooting the same thing. His little force field's down. Is that it? Aha! I got it! The war's over! Just keep shooting, just in case there's some other reason we need to. The, the war's over, apparently. I got a shield. Hey, we have no use for it now. Because the war's over! There he is. The target Earth man. No, that it's um, it's the assault suit, Lenos. Lenos. I don't know. Doesn't matter. Because we finished it. Let's look at him walking away from the flames and not looking back, like a true hero. Uh oh, what's this? May as well watch this end cutscene. I say cutscene. He still walks on. No fear. Let's leave. And there's that woman that he was talking to before the end of this mission. Well, he didn't die. So it's not like a war film. Where he makes promises about what he's going to do when he gets back. And is obliterated. What's this? What's this? And that's it. So that was Target Earth. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have, please feel free to hit that like button, maybe add a subscription, and I'll see you all again next time. For now, though, it's goodbye.